Today was the final scheduled hearing ahead of Karen Reed's highly anticipated murder trial. During it, we learned we're going to have to wait a little longer until this trial gets underway. NBC 10's John Maroney is live outside Norfolk Superior Court in Denham to explain. John, good evening. Good evening, Glenn. There is a lot of anticipation about this trial, but it has been delayed because of new evidence from the U.S. attorney. We will be filing a motion for extraordinary governmental misconduct based on certain evidence that we've just received. Karen Reed's attorney is looking for more time to prepare the case, even after her trial was pushed back more than a month. So it's a five-week continuance of this jury trial. Judge Beverly Canoni set a new trial date of April 16th based on communications with the U.S. Attorney's Office, which in recent days gave prosecutors and the defense volumes of material related to its own investigation of the high-profile case. Defense attorney Alan Jackson told the judge the five-week extension will not be enough. The defense was given 3,100 pages of data, and none of it appears to be duplicative. All of it is brand new, and all of it, Your Honor, appears to us to be exculpatory. Reed's accused of killing her boyfriend, Boston police officer John O'Keefe, by backing into him with her car after a night of drinking and leaving him to die in a snowstorm. She's pleaded not guilty and maintains she's being framed. Prosecutors have rejected her claims, as well as her defense team's characterization of this new federal evidence. The Commonwealth would dispute counsel's representation that the material is new information. I would say approximately 90 percent to 95 percent of the material that we received is consistent with the Commonwealth's theory of the case. Now, the judge did tell the defense they could make additional arguments if they want to delay the case even more. But as of right now, it is set to begin on April 16th. We're live in Dedham, John Maroney, NBC 10 Balls. When it does begin, we'll be there, John. Thank you.